Welcome back to Fast Money. Morgan Stanley is getting in on the Bitcoin game in a story first reported by CNBC.com. The company will start offering its wealth management clients access to Bitcoin funds. It's the first big bank to take that step. Morgan Stanley is limiting Bitcoin investments to 2.5% of a client's total net worth. So is this going to be a big win for Morgan Stanley Wealth Management? Tim, it's the only one offering it so far. And if it's a game of assets, it wants more assets under its umbrella. Uh, look! Look what it's meant to, to the Square platform, the cash, the cash app, to have the ability to transact in Bitcoin, and and but more importantly, like Morgan Stanley's won, you know, they, they've won the the battle of the sector for the last nine months. Really, the the two kind of game-changing transactions with E-Trade, uh, and 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 ultimately, you know, you have a case where um, you know they're moving to the asset management world, or there, I should say, they're they're refocusing uh, almost exclusively on uh, annuity businesses. They've de-risked their model. Um, the, the share price is re-rated. It's outperformed the S&P by 50 percent since October. Um, so, yeah, this is another step. And I, I think it's it's uh, part of you know, what have been some incredibly tactical moves. Uh, and, and I think some, you know, some some real thought that's gone into this and also uh, trying to demographically get exposure to, let, let's face it, uh, a new generation of investors that care a lot more about this. So it's very smart. Yeah. Karen, is this a differentiator for Morgan Stanley? Uh, I, if it works, no, I don't think it will, because I think everyone else will follow. So mm -hmm. um, which I expect to happen anyway. So for, for Tim, you know, brought up the good point of them wanting to wanting to go after clients that are younger, as you think of a Morgan Stanley or a J.P. Morgan client as older. And you also don't want your current clients to migrate if they do start to think, you know what, I need to have some Bitcoin as part of my portfolio. It's interesting they have that limitation on it. Do they have limitations on other asset classes? That's sort of... I don't know. That's interesting. Uh, yeah, but, um, I, don't, I don't know if they have that on gold, for instance, two and a half percent of your total net worth. But uh, mm -hmm. yeah, it's an interesting limitation there. There are right. all, all sorts of limitations on this, mm -hmm. but still, first one to move in this direction.